guys. Uh, congrats on the win. I think it was like the third minute, you know, three minutes ago, so you guys had your first turnover. Just were you happy overall with kind of how cleanly you played offensively tonight and, you know, how many assists you racked up? Yeah, I think we played well. Um, we had to come out strong. I mean, coach always tells us you can't take anyone lightly, so we just got to come out the same way we would as any other team. And I think we executed our plan well. For you, Taylor, did end of last game hitting that big three, the little driving there, did that seem to kind of carry over confidence-wise for you? Um, yeah, yeah. I mean, I just got to be confident always. And now, like, if I have an open shot, I got to knock it down. It's so. two. I know they, you, you had a size advantage on them, but you scored a lot of points in the paint. And I know you guys can shoot the threes, but were you pleased with the, with the inside play from just about everyone and, and the points in the paint you guys were able to generate? Definitely, yeah. I think uh, Coach said uh, we had 22 points in the first half that were inside the paint, which is really exciting. And Bailey did a good job grabbing some rebounds, offensive rebounds. I always hoped for sure, too. Did you guys realize at all that you hadn't turned the ball over? Or did that? I had no Did you notice? Yes, I had <laughs> <it>. <laughs> yeah. So, is that something that you've been working on in particular? You know, just, I mean, you played a clean game with seven assists and no turnovers, I think. So, was that something, Clara, that you have been kind of focusing on here recently? Yeah. Um, Definitely. Like, as a point guard, one of my main focus is to do as much, um, as many assists as I can as a, and as few to the as I can. So, um, yeah, I just try to be clean, but sometimes it's not possible. But this game was kind of um, easy, easier not to turn over. So, yeah. I guess, you know, rebounding from that three game losing streak with now three wins, just are you guys happy with kind of the way you responded to that? Yeah, I think we could have kind of dug ourselves a hole there, and we came back up, and we definitely responded with confidence, and now we're on a three-game main streak, so we just got to keep that up. <laughs> yeah. It's good, too. I mean, I don't know if it's good. You guys have finals coming up, but uh, you have some time <laughs> off, you know, before, I mean, obviously you go to Duke next and everything, but is it good to have some time off? And I know you'll be working on series on school, but is it good to have this break from basketball, I guess, until your last non-conference game? Yeah, I think it's definitely needed. Um, we've been on the road a lot, and it's just nice for our legs to get a break. And like mentally for basketball, it'll be nice. So. I guess what's it like? You know, was that a big emphasis from coach not to overlook? You know, having a D two team right before Duke to make sure that you focused on this one today. Definitely, yeah. He said um, focus on this game right here, right now, and then you can think about your finals to retire. Was it nice for you to get some extended minutes? I know Coach was pleased with how you played at Idaho, even though it was a short amount of time, but nice for you, Skylar, to get some extended minutes? Yeah, absolutely. It's so exciting. I love it. <laughs> Simple as that.